so this paddle is um, dedicated to Caroline for Marcus and we'll keep her memory alive so this one's for you mate couldn't be bothered paddling today to be honest but um, obviously we've got to do what we got to do but I just got a lovely message from uh, Marcus from Southwest Suck so Marcus is a, a lovely gentleman very humble man uh, who I met on my paddling journey in Plymouth Marcus looked after us he, he, he sorted us food and accommodation for uh, myself and James who was the filmmaker at the time uh, and Marcus told me uh, a very moving story and tragically Marcus's wife died of a brain tumour and she was a real ocean lover, a marine biologist so she was all about water in the outdoors and many weeks afterwards I was thinking about the story that Marcus told me because I'd never obviously met his wife and in lots of interviews I was always asked what, what was the name of my paddleboard and I'd never give it a name uh, so I asked Marcus if I could call my board Caroline because she was on the water with me all the time um, and he said it'd be uh, you know, a real honour and a privilege uh, which was lovely of him and I've not spoke to Marcus for a couple of months now uh, and I'd only met him that once and he just sent me a text message uh, just now and uh, in telling me that it was seven years to the day that Caroline died and Caroline, she only had two wishes in life and one was to be married and one was to have a baby and, and Marcus very kindly give her both of those wishes before she died um, but yeah seven years ago she she passed away today and I was feeling like I couldn't really be bothered paddling um, although I know I had to but I'm gonna paddle today for Caroline so this paddle is um, dedicated to Caroline for Marcus and we'll keep her memory alive so this one's for you mate How did you find paddling at night, Jordan? I find it quite peaceful. Yeah. Quite peaceful paddling at night, but only when the conditions are calm. Um, well, we've got a bit of moonlight tonight. We've got a quarter moon, so it's quite nice. But when it's quite dark and you can't see a thing, it's certainly not that enjoyable because you just have to feel everything through the board, which makes it really challenging. Um, when it's like this, it's nice. 